hypertrophic obstructive cardiomyopathy is a condition characterized by the thickening of the heart muscles, particularly the septum between the ventricles, which can obstruct blood flow. HOCM affects approximately 1 in 500 people in the general population. It is considered one of the most common genetic heart diseases inherited in an autosomal dominant pattern. HOCM can be diagnosed at any age, but symptoms often become noticeable during adolescence or young adulthood. This genetic disorder can lead to various symptoms including chest pain, shortness of breath, fainting, and palpitation. It is also a leading cause of sudden cardiac death in young athletes. Food now. I mean your your favorite uh, dish. Looks good, your though, food. See, how's all this small small things inside? Obstacles. See, see, see me, see me. Okay, it's small. But mm. mama, there's ma more from the pot. I can go and get right. another. Mama, one. I already ate when I was at uncle's house Which earlier uncle's today. House, okay. Uncle's house now. What did I tell you about not eating in people's houses? I spent my time here cooking food for you. Uh, uh, Went to the market, brought this, put this thing together. Mama, I'm sorry. Your, your best dish. Mama, I'm sorry. And you're going to eat in somebody's house. Don't take Why it like you that. Why are you to do this? You know, thing? Mama, you know I love you. I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry, Mama. Mm? Don't take it like that, eh, Mama. You know I love you. Come on, don't. Mm? Say, I cannot happens. say no. Eh? I can't say no to your food. I'm still not happy. I know. Say more that I no. never forget <laughs> you. I'll be gone, Mama. Right. I'll see you later. Bye. Uh -huh. Now. You don't wake up. You don't. No, 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 no. Please. Hello, is, is this British Medical Center? Yes. I, I, my friend, my friend Idowu has passed out at your plane last night. Yes. My, my address is 509 Edward Lane. Please. Thank you. Ah, British Medical Center. What happened? Medical center. Yes. Where is where is it? My friend is dying on the ground. Mm -hmm. Where is the equipment? Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Excuse me. My partner is coming. He's on his way. Mm -hmm. Fifteen minutes. Let me call him. No, 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 no. Where is where, where? Yeah, yeah, yeah. From medical. Did he even go to medical school? Hello. Can you imagine? My friend is oh, dying. There was Buma. Ah. What is your name? I was almost done with my name, Seth. Why are you calling me and telling me nonsense like this? Hey! Anyway, I'll see you soon, yeah? He you said you'll be here in 15 minutes. 15? Yeah. If I knew I got to be this useless, I would have prayed to God. Uh, playing, playing with his family, with his friend, but um, his friend realized that he just fainted and he hasn't woken up yet. Stop, 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 stop here, stop here. Stop. What did you do? Uh, I thought you my, my friend fell on the ground. We are playing basketball, he just fell on the ground. And this, this stupid woman is not even doing it. Amanda, why did is you... Is this woman, is this the right woman Why did you start CPR on the young man? Uh, my friend, he needs, he needs CPR. Oh, so why did you start CPR? Why did you start CPR? Why doesn't he have IV lines? Go ahead and call it code. We have an please, emergency please. here. Please, I have my friend. We have an emergency. Okay? Go to the Okay, 0.9 points. Can you have some points? Some points? Can you have some points? this patient? Can I have ultrasound start? Let me have the AED. Calls for help. Remove pads. Did you get cardiac 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 Huh? 150 Jules. Shock every rhythm? Shock every rhythm. Shock every rhythm. 
continue. Okay, okay. So, and I have epinephrine one milligram IV push. Epinephrine one milligram IV push. Epinephrine one milligram IV push. Done. Well, I'm your daughter. 300 milligrams. I mean what? I'm your daughter. Continue for one minute. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm on this. This this woman. My color should have been. I don't know if this is the right thing. We're in the middle of a call, Amanda. This is not the time for this nonsense. Doctor, I'll be right back. Excuse me, what's your name? I'll I'll be right back. Okay, can you take this from here for me? You have to save your friend's life, okay? Oh, this. I'm going to give another dose of a meal around 150 milligrams on this patient. I would like you to go get Amanda. Amanda! I don't know where she went. I, 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 I don't I think she went to lunch or something. Okay. Ayo, how many minutes have we been on this call? 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Okay. No more calls. The lines are flat. Everybody stop. No, 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 my friend is not dead. My friend is not dead. You don't who? You don't who now? I'm going to ask you to leave the room so we can take care of the patient. Record time of death, 2.25 p.m. British Medical Center. Um, Mrs. Mesa, please, um, you know, accept my sympathy. I know it's it's very difficult to take him, but um, I wish we could save him. Uh, we did everything within our reach to 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 try save your son. Um, but we will conduct an autopsy so that we can know what actually happened. No one was killed. My son was poisoned. He's open. He's just open. Just jealous because we're progressing. He poisoned my son. No one does know it anymore. But just today he ate in the house. Today he ate in the house. I understand. Because we're being decided to poison my son. I understand. I God will punish this man's generation. Please. God will yeah. punish this generation. Accept my son. My only son. Please accept my son. <laughs> I sympathize with you. But the autopsy will tell us what actually happened to your son. The autopsy is poison. The autopsy will show you it's poison. My own is a poison. I'm oh. so sorry. That oh you, my uh, God. You yes. authorize us to perform an autopsy. Yes. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead. Go ahead, my son. Well, be real. Rest assured that we are here for you. You have any questions about what happened to me? This world. Oh, oh, my son. Oh. Oh. I'm very sorry about your loss. But, like, discussed with you, we, we did do an autopsy on your son. And, uh, it's poison, Abby. No. Um, it's poison. It's poison. So, your son died young of man. Poison. hypertrophic obstructive cardio. Huh? It involves thickening of the heart muscle and particularly the septum, septum between the ventricles. Okay, and no, because there normal. is thickening, right, it decreases blood flow, it obstructs the blood flow, right, and the heart. And that's what happens. Uh, it's a young man, he was playing basketball. What is constructing the blood flow now? Yes. So I'm going what to ask you to my some blood flow. I'm going to explain to you even for that because this is very common in young athletes. It's a silent killing disease because most people are asymptomatic. They don't present with symptoms and it can just happen all of a sudden. I'm going to America. Okay, this is Mesa. Can I, can I ask you a few questions? Okay. I, I need something from you. I would like... Um, all your first degree relatives. That's nobody. That's nobody. Do you have any relations? That's nobody. Okay. It's just me and my son. No, just it's only me. Okay. This is an hey. autosomal dominant disease. Okay. Autosomal dominant, that means that it's passed through generations and Who passed it to him? Who passed it to him? Is it me? Did anybody in your husband's family have I, I don't know. I don't know. 
So we will be here for you if you have any questions or any concern about this diagnosis. Okay. We're going to be here. Um, we'll provide the best possible care to you and your family. Okay. But I want to tell you about the benefits why I will recommend you bring in your first relatives, okay. first degree relatives, so they can be tested. Okay. I will go and look because what if we catch this early, nobody else in your family will die prematurely. I'm taking my son already. We have medications. Okay. like beta blockers that we can give your first degree relatives if they are positive for this disease. We also have other ways called, uh, we have an ICD, which is an implantable cardiovascular device. Defibrillator is actually implanted into the heart and that will, you know, avert early or premature death in events that this relative is seen. That one is machine controlling somebody now? No, it, it's, it's, it's a, these are all preventative medicine to prevent premature death. Okay, so there are so many strategies we can adapt that could save one more life only if you can bring your relatives so we can get them tested. We also have things like, you know, ablation therapy that we can provide. So please, I want you to go check your first degree relatives and, you know, bring them to, to get tested at the facility. Hypertrophic obstructive cardiomyopathy is considered one of the most common genetic heart diseases inherited in an autosomal dominant pattern. HOCM can be diagnosed at any age, but symptoms often become noticeable during adolescence or young adulthood. Many African countries have limited access to advanced diagnostic tools such as echocardiograms which are essential for diagnosing HOCM. Consequently, the condition may go undetected in many cases. Global studies estimate the prevalence of HOCM to be approximately 0.2%. Many patients are asymptomatic when diagnosed early. We treat patients with beta blockers, alcohol septal ablation, septal myectomy, implantable cardiovascular defibrillator. We recommend screening first degree relatives of patients diagnosed with HOCA. So next time, if you have a young athlete playing that collapses during sport activity, it may not be black magic. Think HOCA. Ah, so Amanda, what, what school did you say you attended? Ah, what? The expensive school. Expensive school, it has yeah. no name. Uh, I forgot the name. Interesting. How many years experience do you say you have? Four plus six. Four plus six. Mm -hmm. You know, Amanda, I've been thinking about you and, and, and I believe that you are a disgraced nursing profession. How can I do this? You disappeared during a coach. What kind of nurse are you? You are the primary cause of death. You did not initiate CPR. You did not give the young man oxygen. You do not even know how to take a vial of medication to give it a timely fashion. You don't understand the essence of time and okay. speed. Okay. You are a disgrace. Okay? You are looking at your phone, walking sluggishly during a code. I don't need you in this facility. You know what? You are you are terminated. I, I don't want to see you here. I, I don't want to see you here. Okay? I don't want to see you here. Okay? I, I don't want to see you here. Oh, I was about to check my nails next week. Oh, ah, that's what you.